Good morning. This is day three of Manila. We're gonna wake up. Oh, I see we woke up already. Uh, today, we're gonna go for a quick workout and then we're gonna go to the buffet. Here, it's called a uh, brasserie um, at three or something like that. So, yeah, see you in a bit. Out, we worked out an empty stomach, and now we're gonna go eat a buffet. <laughs> we're so tired, just because we didn't eat anything all day. Well, all morning. I'm tired, you're tired. There's so much to do right now. Okay. Hello. Salmon, beef noodle soup, some uh, cured meat. I get everything on the Filipino side menu. Ube, what is it? Ube something? Ube? Chaparrado. That's very good. What was that? Aristotle. Aristotle? Yeah. And you got some bacon. This is some. It looks good. And it's a copy. So this is our first time trying this. It's like congee. Oh. It's really good. You like it? Congee pretty much. Well, I like it. It's better than the pinnacle. Mmm. This guy is making it really nice. It's really creamy too. Yeah. Wow. I approve. So I'm set by this and I'm a big Ube fan. I mean, it's a bit interesting. It's like um, more it has more texture. To it. it has more texture to it. What I'm excited about is are these? Yeah, um, pork tocino here is like some sort of sweet pork. Um, chicken adobo, just table. Then we got some. I know this was this is like some. What's that? Pinapet. Pinapet. Some sort. Of, I need all vegetables, right? Yes, they have um some garlic. Mm. Oh, that corn looks good. Find the vegetables first. Green tea. Same check green tea. Mmm. Tastes like a Chinese stir fry. But a bit more on the sweet, sweet side than the salty side. Find the pork. 
mm. three, four. Very good. And then chicken double. Mm. Chicken's a bit dry. The flavor is there, but it's a bit dry. Got some pasi dal. It's really similar to like a Chinese dish. So we got some pitak juice here. The one on the right is four seasoned, the one on the left is pineapple and lettuce. It'd be good for our gut after all we ate. Oh, so full. Just kidding. There's only round one. Is that the pineapple lettuce one? That doesn't taste that bad. It's like pineapple. I can barely taste the lettuce. This is healthy? No. Oh, it's good though. It's like a very small hint of lettuce. That's really good. And we have the four seeds in here. Lots of berries. But oh, I, I really like this one. I could drink like four of these. So I got a beef noodle soup. This one I'm, I'm excited to try. It smells like pho, but it's probably, it's probably not pho. Ooh, noodles are really good. Noodles are chewy. Tender and chewy. And uh, the, the broth is just, I think, I think it's just sort of Filipino beef broth. Not quite sure. It's definitely not flat though. I added some fatty meat pieces in here. It's so good. Uh, breakfast Mackey. Uh, this is uh, e, e dam cheese. And then this is, I don't know, this is a Filipino cheese called Quesan Petit. And this is a pear and feta salad. Yeah. You want to try this one? No. I don't like vegetables. <laughs> Round one done. I eat most of my food. Put some cheese now. So that was Filipino cheese. This is mozzarella for sour. A sour mozzarella. <laughs> Round two, some bacon, egg, and some dim sum. So I don't know how to stop with an egg, but... It's a little bit hard. Boiled. Sell it in the streets. Da, 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 da. And I would 
Oh, that's it? No more topping? Yeah. Oh. That's it. That's, okay. that's the OG one. So the best part of any meal is the dessert and the breads. Oh, look at this. We got banana bread, we got blueberry desserts, and some Filipino breads and desserts. Tahoe. Oh, it'd be my first time trying that. Some more ubei desserts. Well, not dessert bread. And the almond bread. Yeah, you can mix it. Oh, it's Um, but tapioca, brown sugar. Yeah, very soft. Soft tofu. Oh, it tastes like soy milk with brown sugar, but in a solid form. Tastes like boba. <laughs> yeah, I know. It's a little bit, does it? It has like all the boba textures. Mmm. Yeah, is good. Very chewy. Mm. Not, sure, not sure what this was, but ube, but it's not um, not super chewy. I more of a chewy or dessert, but it's still good. Kind of, it has like a tofu texture, like a medium tofu, not like a soft tofu. And this, another Filipino dessert. That tastes like the century egg. Ooh, I, I, ooh, I like that. Nice and chewy. <laughs> Got this cream puff sort of pastry. Nothing inside. It was like cheese on top oh. and some cream. <laughs> ube panesao with some ube jelly. It's like ube, uh, alaya. ube alaya, which is like butter and jelly or? No, it's just like jelly. Just like, okay, so ube jelly. Like Rice, just and dip no, it. You, you can do that. Ooh. So much ube. I love ube. Oh my god. Yummy. Like it? It's so good. This is just like it's some, it's some stuff inside. More, like, is it more ube paste and then um, that cheese? Yeah. Oh, it's really good. Is that cheese inside? I think yeah, cheese. Mm. It's a special one. Mm. That's good. And then almond roll. Almond roll. Almond roll. Almond roll. My almond paste. Mm -hmm. Good. And you want second bowl of tahu. Has to so, so yummy. Just think it's because she ate it all. She ate all the first bowl. <laughs> Overall, I really enjoyed the buffet. They had a great variety of food and it was all delicious. I would say it is my favorite breakfast buffet at any hotel by far, and I would highly recommend. Give this buffet a try out.